I think we're gonna need another engine to build the speeds up to- Oh! No! All right, everybody, welcome to Trailmaker. So this is a game by Flashbulb Games. Now, I got a basically a very early preview alpha build. So Steam Early Access is what they're saying is like half a year away. So it's bam, 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 where you, how you get this, how you do this. Well, um, the game developer sent me this to show off. And uh, I've been very excited. I've been following Trailmakers even before the name change. So here we go. We're going to start our expedition. But if you look in the background, you can see a number of different vehicles. You can kind of see how crafting is going to go. And you can see that it's going to be multiplayer eventually, as you can see on the menu as well. But when you look in the background, you've got this very big, vibrant planet and a lot to explore. So as we hop in, oh, was that a shuttle over there? That looked like a crashed shuttle. So first... I would imagine we're going to have to learn the basics, build a vehicle, and yeah, here we go. There's a tiny alpha course. We have to go through Death Valley, the Mellows, the Mellows, ha, <laughs> the Mellow Meadows, the Uberdruck, and Doom Island. And look at that, there's actually some wind going on, so it's a nice canvas painting here. Canvas painting, I don't know. All right, so let's go ahead and gather these resources, pick up blocks, press and hold left mouse button. That was pretty intuitive. And essential, and look at that, we've got some new vehicles. Press F to enter build mode. We've also got a steering hinge, so I think we're about to build our first vehicle. Principles of building. Okay. Place seat. Drag the seat from your inventory to the location indicated. Well, here's the location. Let's go ahead and... Oh, we got it. Wait. That's a beautiful... Look at that. Right mouse button to change your camera view. Let's go ahead and drag this 2x4 here. Oh. Guys, we're killing it right now. Granted, these are some basic building mechanics. Oh, hold on. How do we... Not that way. It would be it would be this axis, right? Okay, now... That was actually incredibly convenient. All right, let's go ahead. Oh! We're putting wheels on, but we don't have to put hinges? Well, I guess it would be rear-wheel drive, so the maneuvering would be in the front, right? Traditional automobiles. Place steering hinge. Okay. Oh, that's nice. It all it automatically... Oh, I thought I was going to do the other hinge first. We're getting a little ahead of ourselves. Okay, now... Oh, yeah, we got to change the view. So then it opens up this. Now we got to place a wheel. Use right mouse button to change view and look. Okay. Oh, we need the engine, obviously. Select and save. Press and hold left mouse button... Over the indicator. Ta-da! We got it! Press F and try your vehicle. Oh! That almost landed on me. Is there a way to zoom in? Q to enter the seat. Okay, you can see our speed on the left. We've got a V8 engine. Four-wheel drive vehicle. Oh, look at this! Did you guys ever play... Oh, man, what was that game on PlayStation 3? It was about, like, the off-road racing, and it was a festival scenario. Dude, they were ahead of their time on the festivals. Man, I forgot. I, I love that game so much. It was so much fun. Ooh. Oh, well, look at that. Was, was that just resources, or were those actually component parts? Makes me wonder if we could put another V8 engine on this thing, if we could build a V16 by, you know... Uh, impromptu there. Ooh, what's this little green beam? Okay, so... Oh, actually, we were able to do that relatively far away. What's this? Whoa! Teleport station. Activated by dragging a block onto the pedestal. Fast travel between all activated teleport stations. Reveal new blocks on the map. Now, how do we... Do I have to get out of my vehicle? I need to put a block on there, right? <gasps> oh, God. Oh, look at that. So, I went into build mode, but I actually my vehicle is now... Let's make some trails! So we collected the time features. Longest air time was incredibly short. Maybe we could build sessions of two. Alright, well, let's go ahead and check this map. Experimenting is the key to success. So it shows our vehicle, and then it... You know what? I'm not sure... Can we... Could we put another engine on it? Actually, wait. 
Uh, how do I... How do I... Oh, no. That's not good. Okay, so once I select... Oh, here we go. Let's go... Click to delete. Oh, there we go. That was, that was easy enough. All right, what I'm trying to do is see if I can't put another engine on it to increase... Yeah, let's do that. All right, and then we're going to save that blueprint. And then... What do I... Press Q, was it? Or... Get out of build mode. All right, now we've got two engines. No, 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 no. All right, now where do we go? We came from that way, right? All right, we got to go this way. So now we have two engines. You can hear that the guttural engine noises are much higher. Oh, let's grab that. So, oh, this is a ramp ahead of us. Get some speed. More engines equals more speed. Well, we're ahead of the game. All right, since that kind of... Oh my god, dude, this... Oh, shoot! Well, that was kind of anticlimactic. I'm gonna get out. I'm gonna try to... Oh, that's a bird. <laughs> I thought it was something we could collect. Okay. Maybe there's something up stunt move. Oh, wow, we got a new record here. All right, we're gonna get in this big, big, long line. We could even... How much do engines cost? How much do engines cost? Oh, they're only 15. Well, you know what I'm gonna do. I've got room for another one. The three engine beast. And then we're gonna exit build mode. All right, guys, three engines. Look, we're already just like moving forward. Now, is that because of gravity or because this, the idle speed of this thing is literally like five to six. Look at that pickup speed, dude. Wait, what, what was that up in the air? I think there are parts up in the air. We gotta time this right. Oh no! Stunt move. Well, so there's this little dip, so it's like we either have to time it right, or maybe like build some suspension of sorts. Look at this, man. This thing is just so powerful, it can barely contain itself. Maybe we wanna put more wheels to get more torque, right? You can see, <laughs> you can see where we. Yeah, we really didn't get a whole lot because we couldn't build up enough speed up, so... Oh, is there... There's not really a divot here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna hit this ramp from the back. When the front door is closed, guys, hit it from the back. Dude, this is like a half pipe. We actually made it up. I'm not doing that yet. We, we want to hit this jump. Are you guys ready? Oh, no! Okay. Oh, oh! Wait, what happens now? Oh, well that's nice. Did that cost us any scrap? Or any substance? Was it substance? It wasn't scrap, right? All right, we have passed 80. Can we pass 90? We're passing 90. Can we get up to 100 before we hit this ramp? It looks like we're just gonna get close, 97. And uh, you know what? I guess we need a lot more speed on this thing. And I'm thinking maybe more wheels in the future. So we're gonna get on these hills. Oh. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that didn't, so we, you can repair on the fly, which is nice. So there are some substance over here we're going to collect. Oh God, oh! We can barely control this thing. But there is water, so I would imagine you can build boats, you're gonna build aerial vehicles. All right, we can make it up even at this low speed. We got the torque to do it, don't we? Tell me we got the torque, baby. Three V8 engines. But we can barely control this beast. All right, maybe we don't. Well, we're going to push onwards and forwards. Look at that. So you can get up to 90 really easily. It only takes like a few seconds driving in a straight line, and I think that's what we need to get up this hill. Yes. All right. What's this? Is this more fireworks? Like, congratulations. No, they're just red buttons. Oh, do we have to put an engine up there? Oh, no. We don't have enough. We're three short. Don't drop on me. <laughs> All right. Well, we've got to find more parts till we can open up this save. <gasps> Is that the finale there? Not activated. Uh, not activated, dude. Sometimes my words don't work. Oh, 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 oh! What's up with this vehicle, dude? <gasps> There's lots of parts over here, so we're going to open them up. Open them up. I don't know why I keep saying open. We are going to collect these resources. I thought I saw another one. Yeah, there was. There's two back here in the swamps. 
All right, let's turn this baby around. So I guess one of the things we should probably get into doing is trying out different vehicles, right? Oh my god, yeah. Oh god, it's floating. No. All right, we're going to get out of the water and we're going to build this. And then I'm going to try to pull it over. How do I, I want to pull all of it. Let's go ahead, delete. Okay, I get all the substance back. Perfect. Now we're going to exit that. And we're going to come over here. So this is just problem solving on the fly. And look, you can't explore on foot, but you can see it's a lot less exciting. What are those buildings over there? All right, so let's go to our blueprints. Let's just get the twin back. Drag to create blueprint, and let's get up in it. All right, because I think I think this is probably more than adequate, and it's it's better, easier to control. But I think that maybe extra wheels would be a better choice. But one of the things I definitely want to do. What is this? This one has a yellow thing on it. Is this a new part? Straight pull times two. Light pull for attaching to frames. Substance cost of one. All right, so there are still two boxes on the on the radar. So there's this one. Where's the other one? Oh, wait. Oh, what? We've got a ramp. I don't know where this... Oh, it's a mini ramp. But it is a ramp none the... What? That's great. <laughs> My vehicle's too powerful. You know what? Let's get into build mode and see if we can't kind of... Uh, Put this on the back and we're gonna add more wheels is that right that is not oh that's why let's go ahead and delete that and lower that we definitely want to change our viewpoint a lot so we we're actually doing this right Oh, yeah, okay. Well, that's not at all where I wanted it. We want it on... How, how weird is this? Let's go ahead and pivot it. And make it... That's That would actually drive us in reverse. Oh, that's why. That's why. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and delete this piece. And I'm going to delete this piece as well for now. And I'm going to put one of these here... Maybe we'll get two, and then when we have enough room, no, we're probably gonna need one more, and then, now let's go ahead and rotate that. Perfect! That actually worked out very well. Huh, just doesn't seem like it, oh, no, no, it's connected just like the other one. All right, and then let's get another wheel. And that one's going the wrong way. Perfect! Wait. No, that, that, it was going the right way. Yeah, it was going the right way. All right, now we're gonna make, we're gonna move this engine to the rear. Should I move both engines? Or actually, I guess it's more balanced here. A straight pull, light pull for attaching the frame. Maybe that would be, that's only, two kilograms this is three kilograms it's more or less the same right let's go ahead and just save that blueprint and exit that get in the driver's seat let's see if this is easier to drive because then we should be able to put more engines on it actually it'll still be a little top uh, front heavy won't it so let's see when we hit this jump going i'm wanting to get at least 65 oh that's not enough Okay, come on, baby. Come on, Torque. Come on, Mama Torque. Oh, yeah. Twin V8s. So what's kind of fun is, I mean, it's not very fuel efficient, but my my vehicle is actually an SUV with a V8. And I, I just, I love V8s. It's American muscle, baby. But imagine, like, a small car. Or maybe, I don't know, a six-wheeled strange vehicle. So it's like we can save all these points, right? But right now, I just want to... I think we're going to need another engine to build the speeds up to... Oh! No! 
Oh god. All right. Did we die? I didn't even know you could die. Oh. Okay. We're just gonna hit that. We're gonna hit it, and let's build. So we need another engine, definitely. Now, do we need, do we need the wheels to have elevation? That's the question, right? All right, so, and we don't have enough scrap to hit saving points. I, w I want to be able to build a tank in this game so badly. That would be so much fun. All right, so are we going to get the speed? We're still not at 65. This thing might be too heavy. <laughs> and we're dead again. Okay. Well, let's see. We're going to give this one more, one more try. How do we make this vehicle work? We don't have too many kinds of different parts just yet light pole for attaching the frame I'm not entirely sure why we would want that can we we can't afford another v8 engine maybe if we move it to the back maybe hmm now when we had three engines and just two sets of wheels we were definitely able to get better top speeds, but we're gonna start here from where that tree is, and we're gonna try to we're gonna try to give this. Oh, look at that! Well, going downhill, we almost hit a hundred. We could have set a land speed record in our world. All right, we're at 63 right now. It seems to be like when going uphill, that's our our maximum speed. 75. Is it enough? <gasps> yeah! We broke our vehicle. Alright, now let's get up to our... Oh. I can't even... Alright, let's just... I'm collecting this, I think. Yeah, there we go. Now, are these new pieces? We've got suspension. Perfect for going off-road. Okay, guys, look at that. So that's the objective, right? Um, there's a giant shuttle in the distance. We've got, let's go ahead and check it out real quick. Suspension, we've got the seat. So we've got a straight pull and suspension. I wonder why they're rotated like that. Oh, look at that. That's pretty neat. So let me know the kind of vehicle you think we need to da, 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 to get to the space shuttle. And ladies and gentlemen, I will see you in the next episode. I hope you guys are having an excellent Friday. The weekend is right around the corner. And I think we've got another video on trail makers. See you guys soon.